Welding aluminium with a low budget uh, MIG welder. In this video I want to focus on the on the gun and uh, on the mold, uh, the transfer mold necessary for welding aluminium. Now in order to show you the transfer modes I'm going to take the gas shroud off. When the tip is close to the workpiece, that will be short cut circuit transfer mode. Okay. When it's moved back slightly, maybe about three eighths of an inch, that would be globular transfer mode. And then three quarters of an inch from the workpiece, that's spray transfer mode. Now it's spray transfer mode we need when welding aluminium. So that's why the tip has to be three quarters of an inch, 80 and 90 mm thereabouts, it's not that critical, away from the workpiece. It will not weld to, uh, and create enough heat and weld if it's in a short circuit transfer mode or in globular mode. It has to be in spray transfer mode. And that's, uh, that's one of the issues um, regarding uh, if, if you're trying to attempt to uh, weld aluminium with a low budget welder. That basically, if you don't take into consideration, or in conjunction with this, if you don't, uh, if you forget for a moment about the uh, the voltage and the amperage, all the transfer modes are and signify is the distance the tip is from the work. It changes as it's pulled away, and when the furthest, it, it, the further you have it from it, about three quarters of an inch or eighteen mm thereabouts, that spray transfer mode. You'll see the change in the mode of, tra of, of of the weld, and that's why you need it for aluminium. Okay. Now, another issue, by the way, I've taken the gas shroud off, but the gas shroud needs to be on. It was just to show you, to give you an idea. Now, another issue with it is uh, melting in the tip, or uh, season to the tip. Now, you really got to whack the speed up on the delivery of the aluminium wire uh, in order to be able to, uh, to be able to, uh, you know, uh, avoid maybe a transfer of the heat coming back to the tip. So, um, Whack the speed up and walk your way back from going too fast as opposed to walking your way up from going too slow. And uh, that's basically it. Remember also to push the gun when welding aluminium. 